Ms. Samuelson, uh, when we talk about the role that shareholder primacy plays in global climate change, um, how do you think that companies can move beyond paying lip service to sustainability and commit real resources to help fight that particular cause? Well, these, these are definitely created, but I, can I steal a little time to respond to your earlier question? You can have 45 seconds. When, when, the shareholder, when shareholder primacy really took off, it was in the early 80s. And what, what happened is, yes, there was this Milton Friedman-esque idea that you know, we needed to put shareholders, we needed a single objective function. We needed to wake up corporations, and there was some truth in that, perhaps. But what happened is, in the 1980s, we started connecting the, um, the CEO pay back to stock. Right. Silicon Valley loved this. They could hire people cheap and promise them stock, and things really then began to take off. It also happened in 1993 when Clinton put a $1 million cap on what could be deducted of the CEO's pay. And that then really took off. Stock options really took off at that point. You really got to go back to that point is when this whole thing really started to launch and really took on steam.